What is up, guys? It's your man, Jay Will. So the good folks at GPAL reached out to me again. I've actually worked with them on lots of things for the Note 8 and other devices. But they've got a new uh, magnetic uh, quick release type of cable. Um, and it, it's not just a USB cable. It's a uh, USB cable that does 2.4 amps uh, with syncing speeds up to 480 megabits per second. So I'm going to crack. They have it for, I have it for the iPhone and also have it for... Um, USB type C uh, and they have looks like they have three kinds they've got type C regular micro USB and lightning cable so this is lightning cable and this is type C so I'll just I got my note next to me so I'll just grab the, the note and demo it with that one as you can see here you can leave whoa golly dude this thing is strong it's quick you can leave it attached if you want to but here it is for lightning cable as you can see here same thing nice this one is certified <laughs> that's crazy ain't it yeah so we'll put it inside um i'll just demo it for you with the note since i have that device close to me um you get a nice long cable and you get this part here so you can wrap it up wow this is a very long cable it's about six feet looks like uh, so I'm going to put this part actually into the the phone. That's pretty sweet. That doesn't that doesn't really um, do too much to the phone. I'm going to plug this in. So I've got it plugged in, and when I do the drop the magnet close to it, it should start to charge. It's got a little green indicator there, as you can see. So it's getting some power, and it charges. <laughs> That's pretty sweet. Uh, so quick release. I'm actually going to leave this plugged into here because you know the Note 8 has a headphone jack, so that's a huge plus for a phone that has a headphone jack. This is great. Again, just get it. Wow, that thing is strong, pretty strong. And if you're going to be doing data transfer, uh, it's actually really good as well. So you just pull your phone off, and boom, pretty nice. Uh, yeah. And if I need to sync something with my computer, I can leave that in there. That's pretty sweet. So I'll put it on with a case. Oh, there we go. But this is actually pretty cool. I'm really feeling it. So they have it for micro USB. They have USB type C as I'm demoing right here. And then they also have lightning cable as well. So uh, this is a really great idea. Um, kind of like Max, like, you know, the old Max when they had the little thing on there. You know, the only thing is you just try not to lose this. It's actually in there really tight, so it's a tight fit. So I don't think I'll ever lose this, at least not real easy. Uh, but um, this is nice. The cable, let me show you the cable here. The cable is a nice braided cable, tangle-free it appears, very strong. I think this is nice. I don't review very many USB cables, but I agreed to review this one because I thought this was very eclectic and very different. Uh, for for smartphones and data transfer and lightning, it's, iPhone people, you should rejoice because um, that's something that's really good for you for your car or whatever. Uh, just just having something that's certified, I guess, for the iPhone or Apple uh, Apple products on iOS is it seems to be difficult nowadays. Because I've gotten a lot of cables uh, they're, they're they say they're certified, but they're actually really not. And these cables are definitely probably interchangeable. I would, no, not the Apple one. I don't think. I don't know. It probably is. I don't know. I'm pretty sure this can charge this, but the Apple cable, I don't know. So you might that's something you might want to consider. Uh, but get you a couple of these. I'll have links in the description to all three of them. Uh, it's your man, Jay Will. I'll see you guys in the next video. This is nice.